In today's video, we look at the best documentaries about British history. Over the years, documentaries have proven to be a powerful medium for sharing vivid accounts of British history. These informative films bring facts and events to life and allow viewers to immerse themselves in a bygone era. People who are interested in exploring the essence of the nation's past can delve into various topics, ranging from wars and revolutions to the monarchy, craftsmen, and social change. A well-crafted documentary about British history can provide an engaging narrative and insight into the stories and lives of the people who shaped it. The best History of England movies, through their storytelling and meticulously researched information, have served as essential educational resources that entertain while imparting wisdom. They help explain complex histories and provide a multifaceted overview of how the events unfolded. These films display sterling storytelling, exceptional cinematography, and primary source material. They frequently feature interviews from experts in the field, ensuring audiences receive comprehensive, accurate, and engaging accounts of British history. If you like our videos, support us with a thumbs up, subscribe to Factual America, activate the little bell, and look forward to the videos we upload for you every week. First up is A History of Britain, TV series 2000-2002. A History of Britain is a compelling documentary series that aired from 2000 to 2002. The series provides a comprehensive overview of British history, spanning from the earliest prehistoric times to the dawn of the 21st century. Narrated and written by esteemed historian Simon Shama, the series comprises 15 episodes that are both engaging and informative. The documentary series has been lauded for its attention to detail and the ability to bring history to life. Throughout the series, the viewers are treated to stunning visuals and a captivating narrative that explores not only the great achievements and heroic moments in British history, but also delves into the darker aspects and controversies, ensuring a balanced portrayal. Some highlights of the series include episodes such as Conquerors, which examines the arrival of William the Conqueror and the transformative impact his reign had on England. Another standout episode, The Wrong Empire, explores the consequences and long-lasting effects of the British Empire, as well as the ethical and moral debates that ensued. A History of Britain offers an accessible and engaging journey through British history that can captivate and educate both history enthusiasts and casual viewers alike. With its thorough and balanced presentation, the series remains a valuable resource for understanding the complex and fascinating narrative of Britain's past. Next up is the First Georgians, the German kings who made Britain. This fascinating documentary delves into the often overlooked era of the German monarchs who ruled Britain between 1714 and 1837. This period in British history marked the reign of King George I and his successors, George II, George III, and George IV. The film sheds light on their contributions in shaping Britain's culture, politics, and the monarchy itself. At the start of the 18th century, Britain faced a potential crisis with the death of Queen Anne and the lack of a direct heir. To maintain political stability, the British government sought a new ruler from the German House of Hanover. The documentary meticulously covers how the German kings not only secured the throne, but also contributed to modern Britain's foundation. In conclusion, the first Georgians offers valuable insight into the German kings' role in forging modern Britain. This documentary presents a comprehensive and engaging narrative of a critical period in British history, making it a must-watch for history enthusiasts and documentary fans alike. At number three, we have Secrets of Great British Castles, 2015. This six-part television documentary series first aired in 2015. Hosted and written by historian Dan Jones, the series covers six different castles throughout the United Kingdom delving into their rich history and uncovering the lesser-known secrets within their walls. Each episode focuses on a specific castle, starting with Warwick Castle, which dates back to the 11th century and was built by William the Conqueror. The series then moves on to the Tower of London, 
a royal palace and fortress that has played a significant role in British history. Other featured castles include Edinburgh Castle, Carnarvon Castle, Stirling Castle, and York Castle, with each location adding to the diverse landscape of British history. Throughout the series, Dan Jones provides a unique insight into each castle's history and guides the viewers on a journey uncovering stories of power, politics, and betrayal. He examines the architectural features of each castle, as well as their strategic importance during various historical events. Moreover, the series delves into the daily lives of the people who inhabited these castles throughout the centuries, offering an understanding of how they lived, worked, and interacted within the confines of these iconic structures. To bring the past to life, the documentary incorporates reenactments of key historical moments and utilizes expert interviews to help explain the importance of the castles and their inhabitants in shaping British history. In summary, Secrets of Great British Castles is a captivating documentary series that offers a comprehensive and engaging exploration of the history of six prominent castles in the United Kingdom. Through expert analysis and storytelling, the series provides viewers with a fascinating look into the rich historical narratives associated with these awe-inspiring structures. Here we have Britain's Bloodiest Dynasty, 2014. Britain's Bloodiest Dynasty is a captivating four-part documentary series that delves into the tumultuous history of Britain's Plantagenet dynasty. The series, released in 2014, captures the attention of its viewers by painting a vivid picture of the power struggles, betrayals, and tumultuous reigns that characterized this period of British history. The central focus of the documentary is on the four key rulers of the Plantagenet dynasty. Henry II, Richard the Lionheart, King John, and Henry III. Through expert analysis, historical records, and dramatic reenactments, the series sheds light on how the actions of these rulers shaped Britain during the 12th and 13th century. Henry II, 1133 to 1189. The documentary begins with the reign of Henry II, who is depicted as an enigmatic ruler, whose ambition and intelligence brought order and stability to England. His expansion of the legal system and establishment of new administrative structures are highlighted as core achievements of his rule. Richard the Lionheart, 1157 to 1199. The second episode chronicles the life and reign of Richard the Lionheart, known for his personal bravery in battle and his role in the Third Crusade. The documentary explores Richard's complex relationship with his father, Henry II, and sheds a light on his enduring impact on English culture and society. King John, 1166 to 1216. This episode chronicles the turbulent reign of King John, who is often considered one of England's most controversial rulers. His infamous signing of the Magna Carta, which became the cornerstone of English common law, is recounted in detail as well as his struggles with France and the Church. Henry III, 1207 to 1272. The final episode examines the reign of Henry III, who, despite being a weak and ineffective ruler, presided over a period of increased political and economic stability in England. The documentary examines how Henry's reliance on both tradition and innovation shaped his rule and the future of the English monarchy. In addition to these key rulers, the documentary provides a broader context for understanding the Plantagenet dynasty, including their connections to other European monarchies, the Crusades, and critical developments in English law and governance. Britain's bloodiest dynasty, with its engaging storytelling and well-researched insights, is a must-watch for anyone interested in British history. She-Wolves, England's Early Queens, 2012, is a captivating 2012 documentary series presented by historian Helen Castor. This series takes viewers on a journey through British history, focusing on the lives and reigns of four influential 12th and 13th century English queens, Matilda, Eleanor of Aquitaine, Isabella of France, and Margaret of Anjou. The documentary aims to provide insight into the power dynamics and struggles faced by these women, who often wield significant influence despite being excluded from ruling in their own right. 
The title she-wolves stems from a term historically used to describe these queens' strong and assertive nature, challenging the traditional norms of male-dominated medieval society. Throughout the series, Castor utilizes a mix of expert interviews, original sources, and historical reenactments to paint a vivid picture of each queen's life and reign. Matilda's story, for example, highlights her tumultuous battle for the throne and her eventual recognition as the Lady of the English. Eleanor of Aquitaine's segment delves into her struggle for independence, marriage to two kings, and prowess in diplomacy solidifying her legacy as one of the most powerful women in the medieval world. In another compelling segment, the series looks at Isabella of France, also known as the She-Wolf of France. Her tumultuous marriage to Edward II eventually led her to take matters into her own hands, leading an invasion against her husband, placing her son on the throne, and ruling as his regent. Finally, Margaret of Anjou's story emphasizes her key role during the War of the Roses. She portrays her as a driven queen, fighting desperately for her family's claim to the English throne. Accompanied by beautiful visualizations of the era's architecture, artwork, and landscapes, She-Wolves, England's early queens, offers viewers a compelling and well-researched look at some of the lesser-known yet fascinating female figures in British history. Digging for Britain 2012 is a remarkable documentary series that offers insightful glimpses into British history. The series, presented by the esteemed archaeologist Dr. Alice Roberts, showcases various archaeological digs that unearth significant historical artifacts, landscapes, and stories. In Digging for Britain, viewers are transported to various locations across England, Wales, Scotland, and Northern Ireland. The series uncovers impressive historical finds, offering viewers a comprehensive understanding of the historical events and the lives of those who shaped the British landscape as we know it today. Noteworthy episodes include uncovering a Roman villa in the Cotswolds, exploring a Neolithic monument in Orkney, and unearthing a World War II bunker in East Anglia. Each episode features expert commentary and analysis from various academics and archaeologists, providing a well-rounded perspective on the findings. Throughout the series, Dr. Alice Roberts guides viewers with her clear, knowledgeable, and confident demeanor. As a well-respected commentator in her field, her expertise and passion for history are evident in each episode, allowing viewers to appreciate the incredible discoveries made. Digging for Britain is an excellent resource for enthusiasts of British history, as it presents reliable and well-researched information without exaggeration or false claims. The mixture of fascinating stories, striking visuals, and engaging first-person narratives promises an enjoyable and educational experience for any viewer interested in understanding the rich history of the British Isles. Michael Wood's Story of England, 2010 is a remarkable and informative six-part documentary series from British historian and broadcaster Michael Wood. Airing in 2010, the series presents a comprehensive and captivating account of England's history from its earliest days to the present era. The documentary primarily focuses on the town of Kibworth in Leicestershire, which serves as a microcosm of England's broader history Wood uncovers the story of a single village's evolution over time by using detailed local records, archaeology, and oral accounts. This approach allowed him to delve into the lives of ordinary people and demonstrate their role in shaping national events. A strength of Michael Wood's approach is his incorporation of various historical sources and methods, such as archaeological digs, local records, and interviews with descendants of Kibworth's residents. This multifaceted approach provides a rich and layered understanding of the village's history. The documentary's significance lies in its ability to make history relatable and accessible by showcasing how ordinary people have been integral in shaping the course of England's past. Its focus on Kibworth, rather than a more prominent city or region, emphasizes the notion that every community story is valuable and worth examining. In conclusion, Michael Wood's Story of England 
is a must watch for those interested in British history and looking for a unique perspective on the nation's past. Through its innovative narrative and detailed research, the series offers an engaging and educational experience that helps viewers understand the fabric of England's history. At number eight, we have Back in Time for the Factory, 2018. It is a fascinating documentary that delves into the rich history of British industry. Covering a wide range of topics, from the emergence of the factory system to the environmental and social aspects of industrialization, the series provides a comprehensive understanding of the factors that shaped Britain's economic development. The documentary takes viewers on a journey through different time periods, showing how British factories evolved over the years. In one instance, it illustrates the transition from the early water-powered mills of the 18th century to the steam-powered factories of the 19th century. The Industrial Revolution played a significant role in this transformation as it spurred numerous technological advancements and improvements in production methods. Throughout the series, viewers are also introduced to various industries' working conditions and labor practices. The textile industry, for example, is highlighted for its long hours, low wages, and harsh working environment. By exposing these realities, Back in Time for the Factory offers a sobering look at the human cost of the rapid industrial expansion. Another key aspect of the series is its focus on factory life's social and cultural aspects. The role of women in the workforce is examined, with particular emphasis on the changes in gender roles and the expectations they face. Additionally, the documentary delves into how factory work influenced community dynamics, leading to the formation of unions and the fight for workers' rights. In summary, Back in Time for the Factory is a compelling documentary that offers a well-rounded and informative account of British industrial history. Through its exploration of the factory system's technological, economic, social, and ecological aspects, the series provides viewers with valuable insights and a greater understanding of the forces that shaped the country's past. The Royal House of Windsor, 2017 is an essential part of British history and has been the subject of several captivating documentaries. These documentaries provide an in-depth look at the modern British monarchy and its rich history. The Royal House of Windsor 2017 is a must-watch for anyone interested in the British royal family. The six-part series chronicles the House of Windsor's journey over the past century. From King George V's reign to Queen Elizabeth II's reign, the series delves into the family's triumphs and challenges. The documentary utilizes archive materials, interviews, and expert analysis to paint a comprehensive picture of the Windsor dynasty. A Tudor Feast at Christmas, 2006, is a compelling documentary that takes the viewer back to the time of the Tudors in Britain. This engaging film offers a fascinating glimpse into the culinary and cultural traditions surrounding the festive period during the reign of Henry VIII. The documentary, directed by Peter Sommer, focuses on preparing and consuming a traditional Tudor-style feast, highlighting the extensive planning and precise execution required to deliver a successful celebratory meal. Historians Ruth Goodman, Alex Langlands, and Peter Ginn are the central figures in this film, as they strive to authentically recreate a Christmas feast at Haddon Hall in Derbyshire, using recipes and techniques from the Tudor era. Throughout the film, viewers are introduced to essential components of a Tudor feast, such as the grand entrance of the Lord and Lady of the Manor, accompanied by a parade of dishes, musicians, and revelers. Various dishes are explored in detail, including the iconic Tudor staple, the boar's head, as well as other delicacies such as stuffed swans, roasted cranes, and savory puddings. These culinary feats are showcased with great attention to historical accuracy, utilizing period-appropriate recipes, ingredients, and cooking methods. In addition to the food itself, the documentary examines the elaborate customs and traditions surrounding the feast. Table etiquette, entertainment, and dancing are explored, providing a comprehensive understanding of the intricate customs that played a crucial role in high society during this period. 
to conclude, A Tudor Feast at Christmas 2006 is a must-watch for history enthusiasts and food lovers, as it provides a captivating insight into the culinary and cultural aspects of British history during the Tudor era. A History of Britain by Simon Shama is a compelling documentary series by historian Simon Shama. The series, which originally aired on BBC Two from 2000 to 2002, consists of 15 episodes that span a period of over 5,000 years. Shama takes the viewers on an immersive journey through British history, covering significant events, personalities, and cultural developments. The documentary starts with the prehistoric era, touching upon the construction of Stonehenge and the mysterious civilization that built it. As the series progresses, Shama delves into the Roman invasion, the rise of Christianity, and the often tumultuous relationship between England, Scotland, and Ireland. One notable aspect of A History of Britain is Shama's emphasis on historical figures that shaped the nation's destiny. He explores the lives and decisions of leaders such as William the Conqueror, Henry VIII, and Winston Churchill, offering valuable insights into the context of their actions. Shama also examines the roles and influence of artists, poets, and intellectuals in shaping the nation's cultural heritage. The series is praised for its captivating storytelling, rich visuals, and the authoritative narration by Shama. It is also a testament to his ability to convey complex historical events and themes in an accessible and engaging manner. Using a combination of archival footage, reenactments, paintings, and on-location filming, A History of Britain creates a vivid and immersive portrait of the country's past. In conclusion, A History of Britain by Simon Shama is a must-watch documentary series for anyone interested in British history. With its comprehensive coverage, engaging narrative style, and focus on influential personalities, it offers an enlightening and entertaining exploration of the key moments and themes that have shaped the nation. At number 12, we have Invasion with Sam Willis, 2017. This captivating documentary series delves into the rich history of invasions that have shaped the United Kingdom. The series, hosted by renowned historian Dr. Sam Willis, covers a broad range of events and time periods, giving viewers a comprehensive understanding of how these invasions have influenced British society. The documentary series consists of three episodes, each focused on a specific era or event. In the first episode, Willis explores the famous 1066 Norman invasion, 1066, a year to conquer England, detailing the events leading up to the pivotal Battle of Hastings and its lasting impact on Britain. The second episode delves into the 1588 Spanish Armada, covering this historic clash's politics, naval strategies, and eventual outcome. The final episode zooms in on the attempted invasion by Napoleon, examining the defensive measures employed by Britain to thwart his plans successfully. Throughout the series, Dr. Willis showcases his extensive knowledge by presenting historical events in a clear and engaging manner. He visits crucial locations such as Pevensey Castle, where William the Conqueror first landed, and the site of the Battle of Waterloo, where Napoleon met his final defeat. These visits and expert commentary enhance the viewer's understanding of these definitive and absolute history episodes. Lastly, we have A Very British Romance with Lucy Worsley. This captivating three-part documentary series explores the history of love and romance in Britain. Presented by the renowned historian Lucy Worsley, this BBC documentary series delves into the social, cultural, and literary context of romance in different historical periods. In each episode, Worsley draws upon various sources to provide a vivid and insightful account of how romantic relationships have evolved in Britain over the centuries. The first episode of the series focuses on the 18th century, shedding light on how the concept of romantic love was becoming increasingly popular. This period saw the development of new ideas on love and the emergence of the modern novel. 
Worsley highlights significant literary works, such as Samuel Richardson's Pamela and Jane Austen's Pride and Prejudice, to emphasize the evolution of romantic ideals in British society. In the second episode, Worsley investigates the tumultuous world of 19th century romance, marked by the influence of the Industrial Revolution, social upheaval, and an increasingly mobile population. In this episode, various modes of courtship ritual are explored, including the rise of love letters, the popularity of romantic poetry, and the emergence of matrimonial advertisements. The final episode covers the 20th century romances, delving into the impact of two world wars on love and relationships. The era saw a considerable shift in societal norms and the rise of unique challenges for romantic relationships. Alongside, Worsley explores the fascinating love stories of famous figures, such as Queen Victoria and Prince Albert, and their influence on the notion of modern romance. A Very British Romance with Lucy Worsley is an engaging and enlightening documentary series that invites viewers to understand the historical backdrop of love and romance in Britain. Through the use of expert interviews, historical reenactments, and extensive research, the series provides an enriching experience for anyone interested in the intertwined history of literature, culture, and human relationships. Ultimately, these documentaries serve as valuable resources for understanding the rich and complex tapestry of British history. They engage the audience with compelling storylines and masterful production values, providing an immersive learning experience. Whichever area of British history piques one's interest, these documentaries are a great starting point for further exploration and discovery.